the Wacky Hair Company since I left school when I was 16, um, eight years ago. Um, and then my boss retired and offered me the business, so I bought, I did an asset and goodwill sale from him, uh, rebranded it, changed the name, kept the staff and the clients, luckily, um, changed everything else about it and opened in November last year. The idea of being my, my, my own boss and being able to make the decisions was the attraction, I think. Being able to decide what goes on and decide the products I had and the staff I had and the, everything about having my own business has always been really appealing to me. Um, at the same time as doing the job that I love, so it was a bit of a no-brainer. I didn't really have to think about it for too long. It's um, tougher than I thought. It's, there's a lot more in, it's a lot more involved than I thought it would be with myself, but that's it's not a bad thing. I'm enjoying it, really, really enjoying it. It's nice to be your own boss and make decisions, definitely. I think at some point I always knew I, w I wanted my own business and didn't want to work for somebody else, but definitely don't think I would have done it unless the opportunity was given to me as it was. I think it would have taken me a lot longer to do it.